Hello everyone, this is Eris here, and we are going to be doing a tutorial with RPG Maker XP with your layers. The reason I am doing this is because I want to share my knowledge with those who may have the program and are not really sure, or if they have just started out and they need that extra little boost. Now to those who don't have this program, please Google it. Do not ask me where I got it from, or how did I get it, or anything like that. Google is your friend. Please love your friends. We'll love you too, but don't ask me any questions like ah. Anyway, the f now as you can see, everything's blank because I'm going to show you step by step on what what layer is which and how you can tell the difference between each layer. Now, okay, right here. This is your first layer. That's where your things like your floors and your car carpet go to. And when I say carpet, I mean this little thing right here. And right here's your floors. Now, I think some moths will let you put them on layer one, but I like them on layer two. Now, layer two, as you can see, it just got darker. Layer two would, would be like this carpet right here, this table, this couch, bed, that that and this except for that and that except for these right here those are things for the third everything else except for this and this that and that okay. you'll see what I mean and uh, third layer it, it looks the same as the second layer but all it is is that you're putting things on the second layer it's like putting windows on a wall or putting it's like putting this on that and putting this on that or that on that that on that or that on those right there so let's get to go let's get going I'm going to use this one and as you can see my auto fill Autofill, flood fill, same thing. I guess I just call it autofill from other programs or whatever. Just click on it and it fills it right away. But you want to make sure that you change it back to pencil. Because if you don't, this is what's going to happen. And you don't want that to happen. Okay, so this carpet right here, we're going to put it right there. As you can see, it, you can make it in any direction that you want to. And just fill it. Let's see what else. Okay, now, as I said, I like putting walls on the second layer. You may be able to put it on the first layer, but if you put it on the first layer, please um, play test it to see if you could go through the wall. Because, you know, like with the second layer, you're going to bump into it or whatever. Now, let's see, let's put in a table bump right here. We're going to put in chairs. I know. I'm just gonna put it on on those two sides because it looks a lot better than say like that and that. So yeah. What's well, another thing I could put? Let's put a bed about right here. I'm gonna put in a little table next to the bed. Let's see where what do we want here? Okay, we're gonna put in this little thing right there. Yeah, you can put some of these things on the third layer too. And I'll show you that in a moment. And then let's put one. That should be enough. What? Yeah, that should be enough. Now for the third layer, there's things that are going to, like I said before, it's going to be things on the second layer. Like for example, you want a window? Just come here. Like have a window. Nah, that doesn't look right. Have a window here. Window here. Window here. Now, as you can see, you got this little shelf that you can put something on top of it if you want to. Or, okay, let's say take this right here. You can put it on the table, and there you go. Then you can put like little glasses on the table, but it looks like one's about to fall off. But yeah, that's fine. And take this right here. Either you could put this on it, that, that, or that, or you could even like do a little teddy bear. See how it looks like 
the teddy bear, your sits right there. If you don't want that, you can, like, take the lamp, put it there. And that's it, really. And then, also, like what I was going to say, if you want it to look like a couch, it's, like, against the wall. Well, no, like that, because it looks like the couch is, like, literally on the wall. You can just, like, have it right there. And that, okay, if you see that over there, that, let's put the little, like, the, yeah, crucible, see? That's basically the layers. If you don't understand it, feel free to send me questions about it. But since this is a layer tutorial, please send only layer questions. I'll get to the other one soon. This is Zeris signing off, and I hope you guys have a great day.